<laughs> all these reasons not to go to the gym, all these reasons not to go work out. I only need one reason. Reason is far superior, far greater than me sleeping in, me skipping out. A big question people ask, how or why do you get up so early? Aren't you tired? Aren't you this? Aren't you that? It's not sustainable. All of these reasons of not to do it. All these reasons to sleep in, hit the snooze button. All these reasons not to go to the gym. All these reasons not to go work out. I only need one reason to get up and to do it over and over and over and over again and not even think about, I mean, a quarter of the reasons of why I could create an excuse of not to go. I just need that one reason and I'll get more into it as we go along with this video. But the reason is far superior, far greater than me sleeping in, me skipping out, me saying, oh, I don't have to do it. I don't believe in that. I don't subscribe to that. Too many times we do that and we fall short. It creates our setbacks. We never get to that next level because we always lean towards Oh, I could just pull back just a little bit as opposed to, no, I'm going to go all the way. I'm going to go as hard as possible and see this thing all the way through. I'm going to count on myself. I'm not going to let myself down. I'm going to keep my word to myself. The how and the why of getting up so early, the how and the why of getting up 4 a.m., 3.30, 3.15, 2.45, they're really the same answer. And it's something that I want you guys to keep in mind, something that I want you guys to think about as you go on your pursuit for being a better version of yourself, as you go on your pursuit to strive and become greater and not be a victim of previous experiences, and do not let past experiences or your current situation that may not be ideal for you define who you are. Like I said before, the reason that I keep in mind, the goal that I keep in mind, a certain person that I keep in mind who's no longer here is enough of a reason for me to sacrifice, grind, do whatever it takes. The cannot it's too much. It was crazy yesterday. I had so many people saying I couldn't do it. So many people telling me it's too much. How, you're going to burn out. Be careful. It was so much of that. And it's like, you're putting those things on me. Maybe it's coming from a good place. Maybe, maybe, or maybe not. Maybe it's limit, limiting beliefs being placed upon me. Because one thing I don't do, I never do, is put any limiting belief on anybody. Just because I wasn't able to accomplish it doesn't mean you can't do it. I want you to do it. I want you to be, be the first. And then I can see that and be like, okay, let me set my game up. I don't believe in impossible. I just believe we haven't figured out the way to get it done. So my goal, my thought, my, what, what I envision is so much greater than the current. I already see it, I see it every day. I, I feel it 24 seven. That's what keeps me going. The how is, I know what I'm doing this for. The how isn't for the current. The how is that, that beacon, that goal that I have, I have to keep in my mind 24 seven. I, honestly, I'll go a step further. I don't have a choice. It's burned in my brain. So a moment where that little second where I'm like, ah, I just, I just wanna go back to sleep. That moment when, you know what? Fuck it, I don't wanna do this anymore. Fuck it, I'll throw in the towel. Those moments, those effort moments, 
that goal comes in. That beacon comes in. That beacon actually looks brighter. And it's like, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Remember what you're doing this for, why you're doing this. And I'm like, okay, let's get back to it. So you guys keep that in mind. You know, I've been reading the comments. I've been getting a couple messages from you guys. Different situations, different circumstances. And I see, you guys see that light and it's getting a little bit brighter. You know, I'm happy that some of you guys found the video and it was able to resonate with you guys. But now it's like, okay, let's get to work. It's not about, I'm, I'm motivated. Now it's about, well, what are you gonna do? How are, we, how are we gonna stay on this path? We, not I, not you, it's we. Because for me, I'm building this community. One thing that I did not have in those beginning stages and have that community, gift and a curse, but now I understand Sometimes you just need somebody to kick you in your ass and be like, you know what, get back on track. Where's that inspiration and let's get to work. So let's stay on course, create. What is that driving force? Whether it's you never wanna go back to a certain condition, there's a person that you keep in mind, there's a, a lifestyle that you want because you know not only what it can do for you, what it can do for other people and how you can be of service and of value to other people. Keep that in mind always. These are things that I do. These are things that keep me in mind. When I get a comment or a message from somebody that says, hey, you know what? This helped. Hey, I was going through it and I came across your video and I appreciate it. That right there, man, I'm glad I was able, truly glad I was able to do that and to help and be of value. So, and we're gonna keep on going. We're not stopping. We're gonna ramp it up because that's the mission. So let's get back to this workout. Let's get it.